All right, chaps, welcome back. I'm with all the chosen. Uh, I don't have time to stream, but I wanted to keep the content coming. Cooper, no. Specialist? Question mark. I think the Hulkster has already been trained as a specialist. I mean, as an officer. So it's April 16th, and the main thing that's worrying me is how underleveled my barracks is. But we all have, have one corporal and a couple lance corporals, which is dreadful. But I mean, considering the amount of losses we've suffered, I suppose it's unsurprising. Bonding has also proven difficult. Kind of, <laughs> kind of screwed this up, to be honest. But I'm consoling myself with the knowledge that this was always going to be brutally difficult with the gate crusher and first two missions we had, this as well as the soldier to be an pool that we had. Step forward. Although Advent clearly intended for these units to be their means of dealing with any unruly civilians within the city centers, it seems they have come to rely on more brutal means of pacification in the time since. How long till we get more supplies? Three days. So if there's something quick that I can do, like an autopsy. Three days, a perfect, there you go. Although robotics is pretty damn good too. I agree. That is an I think robotics task. gets us the, the, the improved uh, gremlin. One day to rescue a defector. Oh. Must launch a report, 10 to 12. Research cash. Resource cash. Let me reveal start. Yes, it's worth bearing in mind now that the default troop uh, enemy level is 10 to 12. There's a whole extra pod, which is kind of scary. Let's see, it's mid April. I can start laser weapons soon. Let's say mid May, we'll start being able to build mag weapons. Oof, yikes. I might have to abandon my desire to get side troopers because. I think it's about 50 supplies to research psionics. 30. It's about 30. And then another 150 to build the Psylapse. It's 180 supplies. You could pay for nine mag, uh, 9 mag rifles. Just the beginning. Okay, so it's 10, not 12. That could have been worse. We're going to send Brannigan forward. Get a visual for us. Stay clear of those turrets. We're still not entirely sure if they're fully automated or this remotely triggered. This turret's so bad. I find it very... What do we have? Surveillance drone, sentry. I think I'm just going to stay up here on the high ground and try to take overwatch shots. I can handle that. I'll command that puts him in half cover, but I need him forward and with a clear line of sight. Be able to flamethrower and uh, rocket. The Knanford, the Grenadier. Who, if anybody, has decent accuracy? Probably no one. Oh, and of course, my sniper. Although the temptation is to start sprinting the sniper off to this side. But as we engage this way, we can get flanks. I think that's actually a better idea. It compromises his effectiveness in the short term, but it's the long term as the as the as the missions as the turns rather tick on. Moving to designated position. Moving to Overwatch. So my sniper is probably only going to get a shot off. Turn off the next. Oh, come on. 70 accuracy. And half advantage. Oh, Signanford puts him down at least. Oh. Incoming, over here. Viper. If my sniper has a shot on the Viper. 
Come on, 40% off. Oh, they are close. The amount of 40% and lower shots that have hit this campaign has been so tough to deal with. I mean, don't get me wrong, 40% is still a very high percentage chance to hit. Oof, the game crashed there for a second. Okay, we've got to take that. We've got the shot, we've got to take it. Snake is too dangerous. Maybe I should have looked to rocket first and then finished the snake off. And that was a mistake. In the name of God, it's the we shall control not chance. Forty-five, not worth trying. But to rocket, I'm gonna try hit these three here. I'm not gonna medkit first because that is going to ruin the accuracy of the rocket. Bring in the pain. But I gotta push forward now. Excellent trooper killed, Enemy drone killed, priest. Potentially not in the open. Okay, good. And I have the lightning reflexes to move that. What else do we do? I would have liked to have used aid protocol here. But he is poison immune and so is the specialist. If I move him forward, we're likely to get hit with poison. It actually helps us quite a lot. As is so often the case, he has the problem with the shinobi. He needs to run in. That is unbelievably dangerous doing so. Where do we run and gun to? We don't have any kind of cover, like anywhere. Yeah, run and gun there. Shoot the snake. Although my shinobi can slash into half cover, so. Sentry is going to be an issue. But can we slash onto the sentry in half cover? No. That is half cover. Okay, so that's the play then. And then just have to hope that the specialist can hit the priest. Oh my god. A lot of baddies. Guns are too quick. You can't savor all the little emotion. Yeah. Poor damage, it's unlikely to kill the priest. Great shot. Oh, that was a nice bit of luck. I think that was max damage plus crit. Which is exactly what we needed. Oh, and now there's still, there's still turrets. The turret's gonna shoot. I'm, I'm very worried. Very worried about my specialist. But everybody, I mean, we've got too many people in half cover here. What are the chances we can get a flashbang out there? I mean, the fact that we've managed to kill six already, though, is pretty amazing. Done, boys. Wish I had packed smoke now. Ow, max damage. At least no crit, though. Seriously, the old 40% hit. Oh, God, don't be a flank. So three shots, three hits, all below 40%, all max damage. Nice. And there's the fourth one in the 20%. I mean, 
Yeah, this campaign is just fucking cursed. But that being said, I have been making a lot of moves that I wouldn't otherwise, like hyper aggressive moves, but each of these hyper aggressive moves felt like I've been pushed into it with no choice, you know? And, and, and I feel like I've had no choice because of how many losses we've been taking all the time. And, and the losses just started from, from the first mission. Few of these guys going to high cover. I'm just not going to have vision that I need. So, where's the turret? It's probably up on the roof. So, if I put the sniper here, if they have vision of him, the turret shoots at him. But I'm just going to have to take that chance. I, I need the chance for a flank shot. Uh. Trooper runs Sadly, straight for the sniper like it knows where it is. But we got very lucky there with that hit. Come on, focus. Finally, a twenty percent shot actually I'm misses. Right. Ugh. I might need to pull back and try to get them into some Overwatch. Good copy. Moving on target. Oh yeah. Heading out. I can't believe I don't have a stock on the floor. It's unreal how many missions we've done and haven't picked up a stock. Say. And I'm having to pull back an overwatch when I've got guys bleeding out. This is just. Ugh. The pain is cursed. That's a nice hit. Forty percent misses. Nice. Carrying a med kit, but I can't get to him to stabilize in time. I don't have remote stabilize. Seems doable. Clutch. I don't start hitting their shots. It's so so I advent. A big problem. Should have checked for the shot first. Nanford, maybe the close range shot like it would hit, but then that puts him in half cover. Well, I mean, he, he's got ablative armor and five hit points. We'll see what the percentage shot is here. This close range half cover, 60%. I mean, a 40 is actually worth trying. Okay, because now I have, to, I have to use the grenade now to make sure that the officer goes down. Throwing grenade! Uh, two more deaths, that's nine campaigns. Ah, now we see the violence inherent in the system. 
bloody turret. Thirty percent hit. Nice. Cool. 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 We shall attack at once. No. Oh, I couldn't take the risk. The man said their equipment could pinpoint a bird at 400 yards. Near it being such a happy cat was a piece of cake. Roger that. Take this. I mean, look, it was a 10 to 12 mission, and it's all Lance Corporal, so. How can I not see the f***ing turret? Ugh, whatever, I'm so triggered. Taking stupid low percentage shots like that. On my way. One more hit on this bloody turret and we can get out of here. Impressed yet? Oh, God, I just feel so demoralized. Solid copy. Go, go, go. I am in haste. <laughs> it really brings home the point of how devastating it is to take those losses in the first few missions. All this cumulative effect. Oh, I see. Hadn't had all those initial deaths, then the subsequent deaths were less likely because you'd have more levels. And then these deaths now would be less likely because you would have had more levels. Because one of the, you know, one of the most important things in the early game is just getting levels on your troops for those skills. Got it. Got it. Moving. And here's a one, two, three, four, five. Five loot mission, Sorry, and I can only grab four of them because I got two bloody fatalities. <sighs> oh, yeah, I agree with that. Oh, Frankenstein, Mars. Back, miles away. Tech guys will love this. Running. Seems doable. I've got the thing. I'm going. Got the goods. Go, go, go. All right, all right, fine. Stepping off. Move, move, move. Commander, we're losing the AO and our forces. Shut in the up, process. Bradford. I'd strongly advise we consider pulling the squad out of there. On the move. Always look on the bright side of life. Avenger, this is Firebrand. 
Package is secure. Don't tell me to look the broad side of life. Firebrand returning to base. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Twenty years of peace and prosperity will not be undone by the reckless actions of a few misguided dissidents today. We stand with the elders. Trust in their wisdom, and we shall overcome this. Shut up. Yeah, the 103 supplies is awesome though, but there's just no way around it. You, you cannot on two, three, uh, 10 losses in April. It's just unheard of. Our previous campaign had less than 10 losses by freaking December. I mean, it's all recruits, squaddies, and lots, but I mean, these would all have been sergeants by now, you know? Untenable. Oh. I don't think I'm ready to call it. I mean, it's, it's still fairly early on, April 18th. Let's give it a restart. Um, I'm going to wait until the soundproofing for the man cave arrives so that I can fix this horrible echoey audio. Uh, so it should be the next week or two. Thanks for sticking it out. That's fine with me, lads. It's been the worst far and away the worst campaign i've ever had like it's unbelievable unbelievable how bad this has been and it's easily the worst i've played as well well next time will be better thanks for watching and i'll see you guys in the next playthrough just uh just to end the campaign